As it concerns the red brand and the blue brand for Raw and SmackDown going into this year's Royal Rumble, it was revealed. Remember to share, subscribe, and smash the bell. Turn on all notifications for this very channel. During the Royal Rumble kickoff show by Renee Young that the winners of both Royal Rumble matches, the men and women's, would be allowed to choose a title match against the champion of their choosing at WrestleMania 34. The Royal Rumble pay-per-view takes place tonight in less than one hour away. The WWE Network will air this in some traditional pay-per-view Outlets, both Raw and SmackDown brands, will be featured prominently. Now, viewers and subscribers, this changes a lot of things. Because now this could make the Intercontinental title or the United States title more relevant than ever before. Because you would expect, obviously, someone would go after the WWE title. Someone would go after the WWE Universal title. Raw and SmackDown, the top titles, the elite of the elite. But maybe, you know, with The Miz making that Intercontinental title stand out, and maybe with the United States Championship... Um, you know, once again, breaking new ground. Can you imagine if a superstar like that shocked the world? Because everyone would be anticipating. Everyone would be expecting, oh, they're going to challenge for the WWE title. Oh, they're going to challenge for the Universal title. But now things have changed. Things have went in another predicament. And I like the way the WWE is going about this. There could be some surprises. There could be some twists. There could be turns on the road to WrestleMania. Your comments, your opinions, more to come from the Brass Room. Stay tuned. I will try to get a Royal Rumble review up. More to come. Subscribe.